All right, hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Sir Jeffers. As you know, welcome back to another Jeffers vlog. Um, this one's gonna be another kind of more of the quick one because I'm running out of things to think about, honestly. But <laughs> I'll, I'll I'll come up with some along the week goes. But this one was actually someone I want to talk about. Um, positivity. Someone that uh, that I met through the uh, NewTubers Discord actually, they had uh, made a comment about me saying that I just reek positivity. And that's, in my opinion, a good thing. That's what I want. I, I, I love being a positive guy. I enjoy it so much. It's, it's really great to me, you know, because you never know who's had a bad day. Um, this is something that goes back to, like, when I used to work at, uh, I've added, I'll, I'll call it the All Mart, like I used to, but you guys already know where it is. Just don't want to, you know, nah. Anyway, so whenever I was working there, uh, I was always noted for being a really, you know, people person. I'd talk, I'd have fun, people would be good when they came to me. They they knew I would help them and at the same time be funny and laugh and carry on, da da da, da. You know, we, we'd have fun. And I was always a really positive person, but when I'm at home, I'm kind of quiet, I'm a shut-in, I don't really leave my room too often, you know, stuff like that. And I don't really go out too much and hang out. I mean, I want to, I just... I'm, I'm, I'm an introvert, that's all there is to it. Unless my job says I have to be, an, uh, have to be a people person, in which case, that's my job. <laughs> so, you know, YouTube, yay! But, uh... <laughs> But uh, it's what I do. It's something I enjoy. Is it forced? Hell no. I seen another video, and uh, uh, from like uh, PewDiePie, he actually made a video about positivity like month, I think a month and a half ago, almost two months ago. And I watched it. and I was like, oh, that makes sense. And uh, then everybody's kind of followed suit. And this isn't my following suit video. This is just kind of like so. I, I wanted to address it. It's like. Um, the couple points were made. Like you know, why play a game if I don't have fun with it? Well, that's what I already do. You know, I kind of already adapted that mentality. It's like, you know, I enjoyed Tomb Raider, but I didn't feel like going all the way through it. It was, it, it's a fun game. It's, it's really fun to play, but to play it and come up with commentary and record it and this, that, and the other, it's just, it's a bit difficult for me. I can't think of anything on the spot for that game because there's just a lot of running around in between action zones and the puzzles are fun. They're just not like, again, kind of nothing you can't really commentary over, but so I just stopped playing. I wasn't having fun with it, so I didn't want to. To the moon, I had loads of fun playing it, but like, and I kept playing it, I had fun. It was saddening, but it was fun. So I kept playing it. And no matter what, through every game, even if it was a horror game, after a couple minutes of, you know, ah, and horror and everything, it was, like, it was fun again. And, and I was fun. I was I was happy. I was enjoying Well, not happy. Let's not jump to conclusions there for horror games. But it was enjoyable. So I kept on going. And that's kind of my outlook on life. You never know when someone's had a bad day. You know, if I'm going through whatever store I was working at at the time, if I was going through and it looked like someone was even having a remotely bad day, it was just a simple, hey, how's it going? Uh, it was some why I say, hey guys, how's it going? My name is Sir Jeffers. It's like, hey, how's it going? Do you need help finding anything? Uh, are, are you good? Do you, you know, you need anything? Cup of tea? I'd say cup of tea almost all the time if I could tell they were having a bad day, like the vibes they were giving off. And then normally almost always put them in a, a better mood, knowing that someone actually generally tried to help or at least cared, you know, make a joke to him and whatnot. So, you know, it's just about being fun, you know, being happy in life. Be good to other guys. You know, we, I, I was nice to that guy. I was good to that guy. And I don't know what his problems were. I don't know if he was having home problems or something just happened along the way or whatever. But I know for that one instant, for, for a good bit of his shopping trip, if not the whole thing, he felt good and he was happier. And so everybody around him could kind of get that feeling of, okay, this guy's having a better day than he was, or this guy is happy now, so we should all kind of be happy kind of like him. You know, I see a lot about auras, even though I don't really believe in that kind of thing, but at the same time, it's kind of just one of those things you can pick up on. You can kind of pick up when someone's having a bad day, when someone's having a bad day, I think it's a bad day twice, a good day, a bad day, an off day, you know, you can kind of just tell by the way they do things and act. You can see in some of my videos, I've had an off day and make a video for it. I've actually scrapped a bunch of videos because of it. Like, it's like, oh, I don't really feel this. It's not, it wasn't good. I wasn't having a good day. I'm just going to scrap it. Hence what actually happened to a recent Bioshock episode like two weeks ago. <laughs> but it's just one of those things, guys. Um, so, you know, when I say be good to each other, just you know, try to make someone's day. If you see someone a little down, a little, maybe, no, not a little angry because you don't want that to blow up in your face. But, you know, just see someone a little down, you know. Say hi, say hey to him. You know, you're out walking around. Someone's kind of sitting on a park bench. You know, they're a little upset. You're like, hey, you okay, buddy? You know, hey, you okay, ma'am, sir, child, dog? Especially if it's a dog. You got to make sure the dog's okay first. That That's always important. But uh, I always try to f not force my positive. I always try to stay positive through YouTube, though, because I know that if you guys see... I mean, I'm not always going to be having a good, a good day. I'm, I'm sure I'll make a video when I'm mad or upset or whatever just to get it off my chest because this feels good. It feels good to talk like this. But I know I, I try to be happy and I try to be positive for you guys. I expect, you know, someone to be having a bad day. I always expect someone to be having a good day. Either now or way into the future when this video is long but buried and someone finds it. 
I would always expect someone to see it after having a bad day and go, huh, well, this guy has a reason for being positive in almost all of his videos. Because I want someone to watch me and go, oh, okay, <laughs> I mean, I'm having a bad day, but it's becoming slightly better because I know that this guy generally cares about, you know, what's going on. He cares about what he's doing and he enjoys it, so maybe I should find something that I like doing and I enjoy and it'll make me feel better. And then they go off and do it and they feel fucking great. Or they hate themselves. It, it doesn't matter as long as I can help start something. Something to make someone happier and feel better about themselves. That is what I want. That is fantastic for me. That's, what, that's why I do this. That's why I do all of this. You know, making people feel good, you know, making fun content. It's like a hobby to me. It's fun. I enjoy it. And because I enjoy it, I can be happy and spontaneous and fun. And everybody else can try to get the same idea. I talk with my hands a lot. I know. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> You know, that's, that's my whole spiel about it. That's just kind of what I wanted to go about for positivity, you know. If you be positive to other people, they will take that positivity. And what they do with it is their choice, but nine times out of ten, they will take it. And they will, like, take it inside of them. And, hey, and be happy about themselves. <laughs> and be happy about themselves. And that'll make them feel good for a little while. And potentially have the effect of making someone else feel better for a little while. And it just starts a powder... Powder keg, chain reaction, explosive, blah, 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 blah. You know the analogy. It'll just start something way bigger than anybody could ever hope to imagine. So, you know, that's just kind of my look at it for positivity. If I'm not happy or I'm not enjoying something, I'm not going to do it. If I'm happy and I love it, like To the Moon and Amnesia and everything else, I'm going to play the shit out of it. Not going to lie, Anumbra, I almost didn't finish because I just wasn't enjoying it. I mean, it was fun. It was really fun. But, like, that end part, there was a lot of times where it was like, is something going to jump out and scare me? And I was expecting it. But it just never would never come. It was just building so much suspense that it was actually getting painful. It was hurting me. I was like, ugh, I can't. I can't do this. I gotta stop. I'd stop in the middle of recordings, cut away, and just, like, stop recording. Go watch, like, a video, and then come back. Because I was just so, like, stressed out from it. It was, ugh. But that's the way I look out on it. How do you guys have, like, what do you, how do you guys have a look out on this? Do you think it's good to always be, well, not always be positive. Obviously, it's not a great thing. It's not a bad thing, but do you guys think, um, like, positivity is key? Do you guys think that, you know, what I, would you do agree with what I say? Being positive will help everybody, or, well, not help everybody, but do you think being positive is a good thing for those around you and blah, 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 blah. Now, if you guys don't, Tell me why. I'm not going to be mad. I'm not going to start an argument. Just, you know, it's like, no, nah, well, if someone's having a bad day, it's best to leave them alone because of this and this. It's like, yeah, you got a point. You do. And I'm not going to fight with you. It's like, yeah, you got a point. I'll keep that in mind next time. But uh, that's all the time I have for this, guys, really. I just wanted to kind of give you a heads up. My schedule is coming back on track. I've got a bunch of days off uh, today, tomorrow, the day after for when I have to work again. So I'll actually be having a whole bunch of stuff go up. Um... And that'll be great. I've got a couple updates running to where now, hopefully, I know my last Subnautica video was had all that pixely crap going on. And I wish I could fix that, but it's just an issue it has with certain areas of the game. Um, one of them being the uh, precursor base, but, you know, nothing I can really do about that. I've tried. I really did, but there's nothing I can really do. Um, for now, until I get a, a, a slight upgrade on my computer. I just need a slightly better upgrade, and I'm, I'm working towards it, so don't worry about that. But, uh... Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, blog, whatever. I don't know, it's vlogs, it's video log, I guess. So, uh, you know, like and a favorite. If you guys enjoyed the content, maybe subscribe. If not, oh no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> if not, guys, I'd say okay either way. Thanks for stopping by, and as always, be good at the shot there, guys. Bye-bye.